just before 2.30 on Monday morning, the quiet of Charles Street in Lafayette was shattered by the sound of bullets ringing through the neighborhood. You no, know, I was sleeping in the chair. Then I woke up to about nine gunshots, and a few hit the wall, a few hit the door, one hit the baby's room. Bill Huddleston lives in the home on Charles Street that was shot early Monday. Police have yet to confirm if the house was targeted or the act of violence was random. Huddleston says he's not worried about his own safety. He's just mad, knowing someone would shoot at a home where his children were sleeping. You don't come to a man's house where he's trying to raise a kid, especially one that's sick all the time. You know, yeah. I got one kid fighting for his life, and they want to come here and try to kill us all. Stephanie Bailey lives next door. She says she doesn't know her new neighbors that well, but she says her truck didn't escape from Monday's incident without damage. They shot the back window and the passenger side window. I don't know if the bullets went on through the house or I know I don't. Scared me. Now in the light of day, she says the early morning events have left her shocked and a little frightened. I feel a little shaken. It's, you know, you, you work hard to get what you got and you can't feel safe in your own in your own home. As of noon today, no arrests had been made in this case. Several calls to Lafayette police to update this story were not returned. Still no word from police if this was a targeted shooting. Alex Dyro, News Channel 18.